One issue with uploading individual content is that you have very little control over how it looks prior to scheduling. Server version 7 has a content creation tool built into the browser. If your network supports it, it allows basic content creation on any computer on the network. To use it, log into the server and select the content icon from the menu on the left hand side and then select the web author button to open a new browser tab. Select the device you are creating the content for from supported devices and then click create. Standard menus allow basic functionality and you can hover over an icon for a description of the function. To create your content, select a template from the template menu on the left hand side. If you've already uploaded content, click the content icon and drag and drop your content onto the page. If you wanted to fill the screen, double click on the content. If there is no content uploaded, you can use the upload content option to browse and upload. Check out the video uploading to the server for more information. The other menu options allow you to drag and drop pre-designed elements onto your page like text, stickers, shapes and widgets. Widgets allow you to insert things like clocks, RSS feeds, weather reports and web pages into your presentation. You can also display things that are plugged into the HDMI ports like digiboxes and cameras using the source option. Click on the page list for a thumbnail view of the page and to edit the time the page will be on screen. Click on add pages to create more pages should you need them. You can also create a master page which will display anything placed on it over every page so it's great for things like RSS feeds and clocks. Once you've created something you can use the play icon to preview your work. When done click the save file icon to save to the server. Returning to the server your new content should be displayed in the content menu and ready for scheduling. If you'd like me to continue producing more of these videos please subscribe using the button below and hit the like button if you found this video helpful. Thanks very much.